I have the Galaxy S24, this is the Ultra, and I'll be showing you how to take screenshots on this phone. Now these instructions will work on all the Galaxy S24 phones. So that's the S24, S24 Plus, and this one, the Ultra. Now I'll show you different ways of taking screenshots on this phone. The first method is the normal Android method, which is power button plus volume down. You want to press these two buttons once and release simultaneously. So power and volume down, press once and release. You can see the screen flashing. It takes a screenshot, gives you the quick settings panel, which you can use to crop the screenshot if you need to. And then you have the option to share, write on the screenshot. Like that. And then once you're done, you can either share or just tap on save. Now all screenshots are saved in your gallery. So when you go to your gallery, you should see your screenshots there. And also there's a special album. If you tap on albums, there's going to be a special album dedicated for screenshots only. Okay. Now another way of taking screenshots is by using the palm swipe gesture. So you can swipe your palm across the screen like that and as you can see that takes a screenshot as well and it works the other way around as well so it's gonna take a screenshot whether you swipe uh, to the left or to the right now your the base of your palm has to touch the screen as you're swiping so like this you can see that takes a screenshot and you can open using your gallery and there's your screenshot okay Now, to be able to use that palm swipe gesture, you have to enable it in the settings. So let's go to settings. And then under settings, go to advanced features, tap on that. And then under advanced features, look for motions and gestures, tap on that. And then you should see palm swipe to capture. That is enabled and that's why I'm able to take the palm swipe uh, gesture for screenshots. If that is disabled, you won't be able to do it. So you have to come here and make sure that is enabled. Now I'll show you another way of taking screenshots. Now you can use a quick settings panel to take a screenshot. There should be a, sc a screenshot shortcut somewhere here. If it's not there, then, let's, then you can go ahead and add it. So let's tap on the edit button to edit the quick settings and then tap on edit and then from the available buttons you should see take screenshot so it's available all you have to do is add it to the quick settings panel so what you need to do is long press on that icon and drag it to this section and release so you can see take screenshot is there so tap on done to save the changes and now whenever you're in a place you want to take a screenshot off like this one just swipe down to the quick settings panel and you should see the take screenshot option there. If it's not on the first page, then you can check on the second page. So just tap on it. It's gonna take a screenshot for you and save it in your gallery. Now, I will also show you how to take scrolling screenshots. Now these are screenshots of scrollable pages like the settings page, for instance. You see this page is scrollable. And instead of taking just a screenshot of this, you can take the screenshot of the entire scrollable page. Anytime you're in a page that is actually scrollable, the screenshot function will allow you to take a scrolling screenshot. So you can take just any normal screenshot, like that. And with the screenshot taken, if you go to the quick settings panel, you should now see the option to take a scrolling screenshot. And you can tap on that and it's gonna scroll all the way to the end or until you're satisfied with the screenshot and then now you can tap on your screenshot. So let's go to the gallery and look at our, our screenshot. So here it is. And as you can see, this is a scrolling screenshot. You can do the same for a web page. For instance, if you're reading an article like this one, which is very long as you can see, and you want to take a screenshot of the entire page, then you can use that option. So just take the normal screenshot once again, and then quickly go to the bottom and tap on that. 
and you can tap as many times as you want until you capture the length of the page that you're interested in so let's capture all the writing seems to be through so once you're done you can just tap now on the screenshot and it should open using a gallery and you can see now we have the entire screenshot captured okay you can also edit that screenshot in case you captured more than what you need you can always go ahead and crop it to whatever you want but that is basically how to take screenshots on your samsung galaxy s24 s24 plus and s24 ultra thanks for watching leave your comments and questions down below and good luck